Happy President's Day, everybody. Happy- please, please, be seated. I'll be the only one up. This is a day where all Americans get together and salute our past presidents by buying sheets and towels and mattresses at low, low prices. It's also a good day to take a Viagra. (laughs) Lady Gaga was on Good Morning America the other day wearing a latex outfit to promote safe sex. Let's look at the picture. (laughs) That worked for me. One look, and I don't want to have sex. I told my hand I had a headache. (laughs) Now it's all starting to make sense. Maybe the egg that she wore at the Grammys was an ovary. (laughs) Lady Gaga's song, Born This Way, is number one on the charts. Number one! And no one is sure if she goes to number one sitting down or standing up. Or maybe she's been holding it. It was just NBA All-Star Weekend here in Los Angeles. A great weekend. The greatest athletes in the NBA, all in Los Angeles, or as Kim Kardashian calls it, Christmas in February. (laughs) It's raining black men. (laughs) Hallelujah, it's raining black men. You know her chocolate Easter bunny looks like Amari Stoudemire. You know that it's a seven-foot chocolate. It was great, really, to have that basketball in L.A. The way the Lakers have been playing, it's good to have some professional basketball back at the Staples Center. Moldova, you guys anybody know where Moldova is? Moldova, thank you, me neither. Moldova (laughs) has been recognized as the world's drunkest country. People drink an average of 4.8 gallons of alcohol per year. 4.8 gallons of alcohol, or Thursday, as Charlie Sheen calls it. Thursday! (laughs) That's Thursday! The world's drunkest country. I guess that's where they're shooting the next season of Jersey Shore. It'll be a bottle of tequila with Snooki at the bottom. Not a worm, it'll be Snooki laying down. It'll look like like a Cheeto at the bottom of the bottle. Can you imagine if you cheated on your old lady with Snooki and you came home and you're like, I've been eating Cheetos. (laughs) You were with her, I just know it. (laughs) In Toronto, police raided a pizza parlor. They found a large shipment of marijuana, ecstasy, and crack at a pizza parlor. They got suspicious when some dude ordered a medium pizza with three toppings, (laughs) $17,000. And you know, like every pizza order, he probably opened it. Oh, man, they forgot my crack. <laughs> Shit. Now I gotta call him back up. <laughs> hey, man, I said crystal meth in the crust. <laughs> Their slogan is, if it's not there in 30 minutes or less, we probably forgot. <laughs> That's where the pizza delivery guy is standing on the, on the doorstep. 
And when you open the door, he thinks it's his door. Hey, come on in. <laughs> There's a new study out that says if you're short, you're going to live a long life. I guess we're never gonna get rid of Snooky. <laughs> She'll live forever. Her and Danny DeVito. <laughs> Danny DeVito's 370 years old. There's a new proposal in Mississippi to have a commemorative KKK license plate. <laughs> a Ku Klux Klan license plate. Well, you wanna check under the hood? No thanks. <laughs> We don't need to look under the hood. The license plate will have a bumper sticker on it that says, if you can read this, you're not from Mississippi. <laughs> if you see a pink Cadillac going down the street, it's only Mary KKK. That blush would look fantastic at a cross burning. <laughs> There's a 25-year-old Colorado woman that has a medical condition that every time she eats ice cream, she has an orgasm. <laughs> Not like you guys, real ones. <laughs> this is so good. Oh, it's so good. Oh. This will be the first time a woman has ever been given an orgasm by a guy named Mr. Softy. 